All right, we're still looking for that 10 piece. I did get one on stream. You could tell it's the same day. I know you're looking at this shirt. You can look at this shirt. I, I could teach you, but I have to charge. Let me tell you, ooh, Super Auto Crooks is kind of good. Anytime you get Super Auto, you got to take it. So I'm testing my hypothesis. My new hypothesis that, that pig is goaded round one and two, then you sell it. You basically, you leased it for uh, two turns at a cost of one gold total. It's a tough one, right? Because like I don't want to buy like a duck and combine it because then we lose the efficacy of the duck and I'm just going to sell the pig anyway. So instead, we're just going to invest completely in getting a dub. We got a lot of sellable units here. And we have no frilled dragon, which is very scary. Does this team stand a chance? I don't know, but our, our ant... It, not only did it stand a chance, it got the job done. Our ant luck was crazy. We got very lucky there. We know you're gone. And I embrace that. I'm not going to pill two ants. I'm really looking for a level two ant. Now I, I'm eating my words because I'm taking a duck. But then I'm... I don't know why that was like to the tune of Mr. Brightside. Because I'm eating a duck... Now he takes off her duck. Now let me down 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 down. I just can't duck. It's kill. I'm. This is a psychotic team. Okay, a one eight frilled dragon. Might want to put a, a croissant on that bad boy. Sure. Yeah. Um. I mean, so it's actually gonna be for your information. It's gonna be a four ten plus whatever ant buff we get. So, it's actually capable of drawing here. It's a very late frilled dragon attempt. And yet, here we are. So this this is one way to run uh, this team. Um, can, I, uh, can I try something fun? Without everybody jumping down my dang throat? I think two... Hedgehogs could throw some people's teams into disarray. I would love to have them at the front. I would also love them to not kill my ants is the thing. So like so this worked out, but I, I'm this is there's a real expiration date attached to a team like this. Let's take our level. It's just really good. <laughs> it's just a really good unit. Um you have a faint trigger. A lot of people will forget about that, but it's it's the truth. Um, now, rest assured, I'm aware my aunt is gonna die here. I think we had a. I, I mean, this is a it's a wild one, man. It is a wild situation we got here. Let's put the ant at the front. Let's let's give give it a chance. We know we're gonna pill it next. We could run two hedgehogs. I mean, our frilled dragon is not like necessarily a long term part of our plan. I think. I haven't really puzzled it out yet, to be completely honest with you. I don't really know what our long-term plan is. What I do know right now is that there's the meta is a shifting sand, right? There's some things that are just better, and that's fine. But then there's some things that are like, if this thing, if A beats B, and B loses to A, don't run B, run C. Maybe C loses to A, or loses to B, sorry. <laughs> I don't know, I got twisted up. All I'm trying to say is in... Uh, like a bipolar power structure, we can make it multipolar by adding a different strategy people don't expect. So if all of a sudden, like instead of people are like, oh, one big unit is kicking my butt, but summons do really well. Well, if summons do really well, then hedgehog like AOE will do well against summons. Okay, so now let's puzzle it out. Is it worth an extra three gold to get a higher tier unit and 2-1 stat points. I'm actually going to say no. I, I think that that buff was reasonable. I think that this team makes sense, although the problem is our turtle is going to die, which means that the melon armor is going to be wasted, which is not good, um, obviously. Full stop. But you ever hear the expression, you can't... Make an omelet without breaking a few eggs. <laughs> it's funny, okay? Like, that's the... We don't need the frilled dragon. I know he's just a stat 
vessel for us. He's getting faint triggers, but we, we don't really care. All right, so it's going off, huh? That's how it's going to be. It's going off. Hold on, somehow it actually worked. Because of the way that that went down, we didn't lose... Uh, we didn't lose the melon armor. I would try to create two of these so people stop yelling at me about combining my units in the wrong fashion. Holy cow. It just doesn't make sense to level up the turtle <laughs> unless we want one of our hedgehogs to have melon armor. But it doesn't make sense, you know? Like, you could combine your hedgehogs and then have one turtle die and give melon armor to... Okay. No, but I love having two hedgehogs. That's like, it's my thing. It's my defining characteristic. Now, you're like a get-out-of-jail-free card in, th in case things go horribly wrong. We at least have the ability to hopefully try to scale out of it. Holy cow, a hit tweet. I don't know, I'm, I'm disappointed because I see garlic on the enemy team. And that... No, wait, it totally... I'm, I'm stupid? The math totally works out for us and is completely fine? Okay. So that's five wins. That feels good. Forget you, then. We don't need you. Just keep scaling. No, why am I... Why are you here? <laughs> it makes no sense for you to be level two. You know what? Maybe... maybe fine, okay? Fine. Maybe I'll work you around. Maybe I'll find a place for you later. Give me a hedgehog or something. You can tell just, just as well as I can. This is the nightmare zone, right? Where, like, I, d they, I didn't expect to still be alive, given the psycho team we're running. And yet, somehow, um, we're still in this. And now I don't have a long-term plan in the slightest. And yet, somehow, I continue to live and, and thrive, even. That's six wins. At some point, we're going to encounter large units, and that's not going to be good. But at some point, we're going to encounter chocolate. Dude, I think that's very important. If we can start to get our teams... And we'll combine you next time. If we can start to get our teams popping a little bit. We have so much HP. I really feel... Like, we can... The, my problem with the leopard is by the time it shows up, I'm usually on lethal. So I'm like, oh, I can't pivot to this because I'll be dead. Um, this time, we're early enough that I'm like, you know, I think there's a genuine chance here. By the way, this it's our first loss. That's so... Pay I didn't know that could happen. <laughs> I thought we were in the clear. So we gotta... We're keeping you for some reason. Yeah, I don't really understand it. Um, you don't matter. You're gone. You're coming up to the front. For some reason, I'm pushing you to level three. And I have no idea where to place you. You know what? Maybe you actually do better here. And you could use like a garlic or something. Can is just boring, so I say no. Two of these is not boring. Why am I not combining you into a... Okay, I'm stupid. I'm stupid. Officially, that's fine. And that's... You know what? I accept that. I own that about myself. We're not falling apart. I haven't even begun to peek yet. My whole squad is dead. <laughs> My whole... Your whole squad is not dead. My whole squad is dead. Your whole... What the heck? Okay, we actually weren't that far off there. But it's scary. So... No, you got to get a unit out of here first. Do you? No, you don't. Yes, you got to unfreeze something. I can unfreeze one chocolate without crying. No, because I want you to level. I'm so confused. You need the level first. Ah! Combine me? For now, buy me. No, for now, freeze me. Buy me. Don't... Oh, one milk because I had too much stuff in my shop. And then you can go off. <laughs> I, I feel like I might have lost it a little on this one. I do appreciate what the leopard is capable of doing, though, which is really breaking two pieces of equipment at this stage of the game. Holy cow, we're going to screw up their whole thing. 
I, I well, we we screwed up one sheep spawning. That's not nearly as good as I thought it would be. I actually thought I had I was a real man of genius temporarily. Please. Just let me get a little higher up on the totem pole, man. You know what I would do? I would sell you and I would place you. And I would try to get you to level two. Please. 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 It hit the wrong... Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Is this acceptable? Is this okay? Does this make any sense? Does this team have a chance? No, my 15-5 hedge... Uh, or leopard at the back is dying for no reason at all. Just, just for a joke. Is dying for a cause, but that don't make it yours. I'm that that was a fun team, but obviously steeped in idiocy. Okay, now this is the team. Let me be a bearded. Let me be a nasty ghost. I kind of like the idea of a desperate ghost too. Like a nasty ghost is straight out of scary movie too. Not the best scary movie. You're so lucky. You're so lucky you took a pig, which is a great unit, and I respect your choices there. But a desperate ghost. I love the idea of a ghost that's like, hey, I'm haunting you. Hey, 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 help me. Help me. Help me resolve unresolved tension from my life. Help me. Why is the ghost talking like Larry David for some reason? Ghostly Larry David. Richard Lewis, help me. Help me, I'm haunting Cheryl! Okay, anyway. That was, th this team is like the platonic ideal for the early game. All we gotta do is figure out how to pivot this son of a gun to the late game. Something I've been historically anus at. I don't wanna combine you yet. I wanna, I wanna wait a second. I want you to get buff as, buff as heck, if you'll allow me to use curse words on this channel. You're going to be like a 10-10 plus ant buffs. That's 12-12 plus ant buffs. That's a solid situation, man. Now the ant buffs turned out just fine. I can't be mad. This team's got like, it, we're, we got inertia on our side. A level on a, on a non-even level. I mean, to be honest with you, I think a dog is also like a really good unit, obviously. But I'm going to, I'm going to mix it up a little. Holy cow. You might get early bison or something like that. I don't know. You're sticking around, so why don't you stick around? Um, now, remember how you combine to get two higher tier units, as people they have requested many times. This is why I don't like the wasp. Your, your great unit traded with my horrible unit. But I'm loving this. I'm loving this. I said, you know what? We're going straight to... The wild, wild west, and we're going straight to as many faint triggers as possible. You could have gotten a toucan in here, passed some meat back. We're only, the only thing I respect uh, respect right now is the frilled dragon. I would definitely sell you and run this insane looking team. And then I would combine you. If I could get, like, a scaler off of that, I would love to do this for you. But I don't think I can justify it right now. So I'm just going to buy, like, another faint trigger, and then I'll combine you next turn. Like, the rooster can go off. I guess it's good that we got a rooster early. Thank you for only being level one. Yeah, I mean, I'm, like, I'm basically complaining about things not going exactly perfectly, which is totally fine. <laughs> it's not actually a big deal in the slightest. We could get a second rooster really quick and then be like really happy with things. We're not really scaling. So that, that hurts, but it is what it is. What we want to see is a faint trigger to keep things rolling here. I don't know, maybe like we rearrange the squad to look a little bit like this. I don't really like a sheep leveling necessarily but things are going real well right now and to get a level you never know what kind of like tier 5 tier 6 unit could get spat out on the level so I got I got some respect for it can we make it here I think we can make it here I mean every squad that we face right now has exactly the same no turtle no thank you 
Every squad that we face right now has exactly the same problems. It's like one good unit and then a bunch of miscellaneous detritus, which is okay. Because as long as our garbage unit is better than their garbage units, we're okay. Okay, probably, I can't believe this happened. But then immediate, after getting the level, I'm like, dude, you gotta, you gotta sell and take a Lynx onto the squad here. No, you can keep the sheep. And oh, the, I see the order. <laughs> like it takes away a, a two two and a four four. That you, you're like a twelve twelve unit. You're gone next time. We're gonna go can lynx lynx probably. I think the hawk is is awesome as well. I think the lynx beats the hawk. Now here's the thing. You're gonna say, go ahead and say it. Your team has no scaling. But here's the deal. Although my team has no scaling. No team has any scaling right now, unless they got Dog or Koala Yak, which is something that we can't stop. You know, we got to play our game and, and do the best we can. So I'm only going to worry about not having scaling when scalers are in abundance, which has not happened up to this point so far. We do have a, I mean, this is very similar looking teams here, don't get me wrong, although they got a better, uh, they're like very, very similar looking teams, although they, they got a much better setup, so they're going to eat my lunch on this one, but that's, that's fine. Um, we have a pivot spot. When melons exist, we can get rid of our turtle. We don't really need a level two turtle. I wish that it made sense and it would get a nice buff here, but ah, screw it. I can't stay mad at this guy. What about a 10-8 lion that would become a 10-12? No, a 15-12. It's kind of pog, right? Am I willing to sell a 12-12 or an 8-5 that does that? I'm not willing to sell anything to fit you yet, but I am willing to kill an ant next turn and hopefully get a lion to let... What on earth? Okay, I've decided in light of this situation, I'm willing to sell a sheep to spend some money faster so that we can spend more money next turn. <laughs> you two faint triggers? No, I think, honestly, our lion just became like our best unit. Um, I don't know if we can... I, I still don't know if this lion can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with like the nightmare teams. Which, you, you have to beat this team. And I don't know that we're... Oh, okay, we're, we're gonna draw. You have to beat that team, because that Caterpillar is going to pop, and that's a good sign that those Caterpillar teams are about to destroy you. But, okay, this is going to screw up our links real bad. But that's okay. You know what? In, in a pinch, I would add a Lioness to the team. No, I can't do that, because now our Lion sucks. <laughs> I'm sorry. Not smart. Not a not a smart play. You know what? Great time to freeze a snail, though. Let's focus on the positive. That's an utterly fantastic time to freeze a snail. Whoa, dude! Hold on. I'm not saying we did it, but the lynx is freaking cracked. Holy cow. I don't know if the lynx could have shot anything that would have given us a win there, except that kangaroo. I'm so eternally grateful. By the way, I love this. Sure, I'll give it a try. I love this. Now remember, you can't take a leopard. I know I just said I love this. That was not smart. <laughs> and don't take a lion that's going to cannibalize your other freaking lion, man. I'll be honest with you. I don't think anything on here except a leopard is worth buying and the leopard screws up our lion. So guess what? Idiot. There you go. You get a freaking, uh, you get a green pepper on a lynx and we run a four squad, but on purpose this time. I mean, I think sniping a turkey is good, but I think we're facing a strictly superior team full stop. So, like, fair enough. It's a pretty good team. Little T-Rex dog build. I would do it myself. I'm not being a hater. I would do it myself if I could. Take it. Take it. Take it. We're only going to have one faint trigger. We don't even want a tier six. Maybe it's stupid. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I want this lion out here. We need, like, 
I need a more compelling case. Don't screw up your lion. In this position, the only thing that makes... You know what? I was going to say the only thing that makes sense is a shark. But I actually think woodpecker, just as an equipment breaker, can do... I'm not saying we're going to win. I think it's unlikely. But it can do something. What it cannot do is break a... This kind of equipment right here. It's not going to break a garlic for you. Yeah, we, we lost. Um, we lost. I'm okay with that. I still... I, I oh, We're not lethal yet. Good, because I was not okay with that. <laughs> I was highly upset. Level 3 lion. I still got this son of a gun out here. But you know what? I got a good feeling this guy's breaking some melons next turn. I just see it happening. We got a 42-42 on the squad. You know what would be a good mode? This is just, I'm spitballing here. I think this would be a good mode for super auto pets. What about a mode where you could buy... Um, I lived. What about a mode where you could buy food but your opponents couldn't? <laughs> so I could be like the only guy with like green peppers, you know what I mean? I'm just, I, okay, do, boo me all you want. I don't think we need a turtle to hit level three. It's just too much investment. You're like one of these away, so go ahead and take it. Um, just so like my opponents couldn't get uh, access to the same quality of goods as me. Is that is that so much to ask? Like, is that too much? Would that imbalance the game or something? If we have to... Remember, I gotta add like a garbage unit, right? Or a unit that's... Not that good. It's good... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for here? I can't remember. It's good inhibited, okay? Let's, let's keep this chocolate frozen. You're, you're just a melon sniper. That's like your whole thing. Or a pepper sniper. Anything's, anything's good enough. Holy cow, this team is strong. <laughs> this, is the, this is the power of the... And don't even start with me, man. People come to me and they say, Look, see how good a chicken build can be? This is probably their 90th attempt at this, and they just happened to finally find the perfect line. Congratulations. Either way, I had a good time. I hope you did as well. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I'll see you next time. I forgot what I was saying, like, halfway through that. I, I, it, Dolphin's not bad. I apologize for what I said about the dolphin. I'll see you next time, though. See ya.